All right, let's get a look at the new head play. Uh, I just picked them up over at Get FPV in uh, Sarasota, Florida. Took the ride down there, 20 minutes and 20 back, and it was probably the worst 20-minute ride back because I was in the car trying to see what these things look like because I just I couldn't leave it alone. So I did uh, open up the box already, and uh, matter of fact, when I was at a stoplight, I did a selfie with the headset on. It was pretty funny. One of my friends suggested that I do that. So, all right, I'm going to take these out here, set these aside, and take out the other components that are inside this box. Uh, over at uh, Get FPV, uh, it was a pleasure working with them, and it's nice having them so close to me. So, let's see what's in this box here. I didn't. Yet to see what's in here. Looks like we have a uh, charging cord. And I would say that is uh, probably for the battery, which is right there. They do get a battery with it. It's the uh, same thing that you would find in the Fat Shark. It's a uh, 7.4 uh, cell 1000 milliamp. And uh, pretty much the same size, same uh, configuration. It does have a little bit of Velcro on the back, which is nice. And uh, these here are for uh, um, different currents, I would take it. It would be a U.S. and uh, European, European overseas. So they accommodate for, for everybody on that end. But I have a charger for this, so I probably won't even be using this charger. So, give that to somebody. Alright, let's see what's in the other bag. You get a shitty antenna. Uh, I guess if you don't have one, it's good enough for you. Uh, some extra padding if you choose to put it on. Um, haven't read the instructions yet, so I don't know if you need to put them on right away or afterwards. And in here, I'm assuming these are the lenses. I really don't want to mess with these and finger fuck them all over the place. But um, I will read the instructions. You do get some cables. Uh, this way, if uh, you want to run certain things, you can. And that's pretty much about it. So let's get into the head play itself. Um... The bag itself, I mean, it's nothing extraordinary. I mean, it's a nice bag. It contains it, does what it's supposed to do. I mean, it's not overly uh, an expensive type of material, but yet again, it's nice to house it. And there they are. I chose the white. Uh, I don't know. I just uh, thought the white was appropriate. So, sooner or later somebody will make a skin for this. And uh, that would be very nice. Oh, I see we have some navigation buttons over on the other side. Uh, which you have your source, your up, your down, your volume up and down, and your menu button here. And that is where the cables go that I showed you in that other bag, your antenna. And I would assume that that is for your uh, uh, channel. Now, as far as what is on the strap, strap looks like a GoPro strap. Uh, I could see probably putting a boom on this after you have it strapped on your head. And you could have it boom up and cant over your head if you wanted to do, uh, I don't know some sort of filming and now as far as the inside let's get in there the field of view I mean is like incredible um, I'm going to power these on I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, testing here so I'm gonna sign off right about now and I will clip in with uh, a video of me uh, showing you the image Okay, here's the image. I don't know what you can make out from uh, the camera, but I'm sure to find out myself when I look. But uh, you can see that uh, I'm getting quite a bit of interference sitting in the garage. Must have some loose wiring or 
something but the quality the image it's going to be something to get used to because i'm so used to looking at the fat sharks and i am able to wear my 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 reading glasses with with these goggles so that is a, a definite bonus so i have to see on how to change because they do give you a lens to change out i'm not sure on uh what is needed to do that but i'm going to try these first and see how i like it see what the standard stock is but the image quality i mean it's it's nice i like it hey walk it around Now, mind you that um, I'm using uh, a Fat Shark uh, 600 TVL camera. Uh, I did order um, a 650, I believe it was. Um, uh, this is going to be recommended by uh, Drive and Fly. He said that this is a very good camera and the quality of the image will be even more better than what the Fat Shark has to offer. So, waiting for that to come in. So, other than that, that's pretty much about it. I'm pretty stoked to try these things out and see how everything works. And definitely a big fucking set of goggles, man. But I don't care. I'm going to be viewing it and enjoying it. Well, thank you very much for viewing. And I'll give you uh, my uh, feedback on, uh, once I fly it see how it is. Thank you for viewing. See ya.